we greatly refined the attack that we performed at Bay Threat. Um, at there, we had to use an expensive switch and an expensive router to get a really fast wired network. And we tried it back here in the lab with a cheap old Cisco switch and router here, and it worked. And then we started discussing how to do it without the Cisco router. And I realized you can simulate the router, and that made the attack much more powerful. So now the network consists of two devices, a backtrack attacker, a crossover cable, going through a USB gigabit ethernet into the Mac OS X, and we projected both of them up on these big screens so you can see it better. So take a look at the, uh, there's the defender, here's the target, the air, and here's the backtrack attacker. And here's the essence of the new attack, is that you use seven windows at once and use the fake router attack, fake router 6 in THC IPv6. The fake router 6 um, function will simulate a router by sending one router advertisement per second. It's not a flood attack, it's just a normal router. So one, this is sending a network starting with one, and a network starting with two, and a network starting with three, four, five, six. So right now, I'm simulating six routers on the network. And the Mac has done what it should have done. It has configured 12 IP version 6 addresses, two starting with one, and two starting with two, three, they're kind of out of order, but it's configured six uh, pairs of addresses. When I start the flood attack, here, or the Mac here, it adds a bunch of new addresses, which is what it should do, but within just a few seconds, it crashes. Can't assign requested address. The Mac is now dead, and it only took about three seconds. If you go to Activity Monitor, you start seeing the spinning blue screen of death. The attack has stopped because it can't send any more traffic through the cable. The Activity Monitor is no longer updating. And if you press the Power Off button, the box pops up. But if you hit Restart, it can't even restart because the Mac is dead. This is really powerful. It doesn't take much bandwidth, and it doesn't take any fancy equipment anymore. That's all.